The Institute of Peace has launched the Nelson Mandela Lecture Series to honor his life, work and passion for peace. The inaugural lecture was delivered by former ANC National Executive Committee member Cheryl Carolis. SABC News Washington correspondent Harry Horton went along to watch the lecture. Ambassador Cheryl Carolis recalled her time working with Nelson Mandela. She spoke at length about his leadership in South Africa and how he reshaped the country in the early days of his presidency. She also shared some personal anecdotes about her time with Nelson Mandela. And she expressed her confidence in South Africa's new president, Cyril Ramaphosa. He has learned very well at the feet of Nelson Mandela. And I'm confident that, like Madiba, Cyril Ramaphosa's quest will not be to seek retribution. He's well equipped to know how to draw a line beneath impunity very firmly, but he also knows how to focus on liberating the good that human beings are so unfailingly capable of when they have good leaders. Cheryl Carolis expressed her concern about the violence seen in many parts of the world, in particular in Syria and Iraq. She also spoke about the political instability in many Western democracies. The levels of exclusion, the levels of poverty and inequality that this exclusion creates has created monsters and a huge powder keg. And maybe it's time for us to take a few fresh looks at power, what it looks like and how it is exercised. Maybe it is fortuitous that we are confronted with these challenges in the centenary year of Nelson Mandela. The U.S. Institute of Peace say the Nelson Mandela Lecture will become an annual event here in America's capital. Harry Horton, SABC News, Washington.